Now that we've learned how to do some basic features of the TradingView platform, draw some support and resistance lines, we're going to look at the indicators. This is where you can add uh, custom indicators or pre-built indicators or even community indicators to your chart. Very simple to do this, you can simply click on the indicators tab and you can simply search for the indicators that you want to find. For example, moving averages is a pretty common one. So if we click on an exponential moving average, for example, it will plot that on our chart. You can see that with the blue line currently. To edit the indicator, we can click on the blue line itself, right click on it, and we'll click on the settings tab. From here, we can change the style and color of the moving average. For example, if we want it to be white, maybe a little bit thicker, a little bit easier to see. Uh, we could change those sort of things pretty easily with basically any one of these settings. Uh, you can add labels on the price scale. I prefer this. What this does is it just adds over on the right hand side. See that white tab that is telling us where the current moving average price is. So you don't have to really guess where it is. You can see it directly exactly the price that, that moving average is on the chart. Again, right click on it for more options. We can change just about anything on that moving average that we please um, from the visibility style we can choose what time frames we want it to show up on so if I want this moving average to show up let's say on a 15 minute chart but not on an hourly chart or a daily chart I can simply deselect those time frames and you'll notice that that moving average will disappear on the hourly chart four hour chart and daily chart but it'll still show up on the smaller time frames like our 15 minute chart five minute chart and one minute chart once again, if you right click on the indicator itself on the chart and go to settings, you can choose the period, in this case, uh, the length of time that the moving average is set for. You can see as I adjust it, it's adjusting on the chart. Uh, we could set the source of the indicator, in this case, as to be the open, close, high or low of the previous candle, etc. Uh, a lot of different options in there that you can choose to go from. Again, this is the style and visibility tab we already discussed, and the visibility tab is going to be where you can adjust the times that is available to be seen. Another uh, neat feature here is you can simply click over here on this eyeball icon and if you want to quickly hide the indicators you can just toggle them off and on whenever you want. Uh, like we mentioned earlier there's all kinds of different uh, indicators you can choose from uh, including Fibonacci retracements which are popular amongst some and community uh, indicators as well which are custom built indicators from people that have uploaded them to the TradingView platform.